Jordan Hart. I'm an instructor at Digital Media Academy, and I'm going to show you how to use Glass. First of all, you can use the Companion phone app to see what Glass sees. So I'm going to tap to wake it up. So what I see in my top right is what you guys are seeing right here. Whenever it says OK Glass, and you'll notice now it switches views, so I'm going to swipe down to go back, that activates the voice command. So I'm going to put that away so I can say it. If I say OK Glass, when I see OK Glass in quotes, then it's ready for a voice command. So this is how you'd search Google with Glass. OK Glass, Google Cake. Now it's Googling it. It's giving me the different results. So I can just swipe. You can swipe back and forward to go right and left. So I can swipe through the different options. So it's figured out that I'm on Stanford's campus and it's giving me relevant results. So I can flip through. When I like one, I can click on it. Click to view the website. You can't really do much on the website, but you can pretty much see it. Who would like to try? Google search. There you go. Go ahead. Go ahead. Just pass around. Um, so when you answer a call, it's like answering it with a headset, except it has video. Search. So swipe down to get back. Is it okay, on Glass? Set? Take a video. Uh, oh. Fifteen hundred dollars. Oh, that was so cool. That was so cool. Oh, I call that Dipsies. Dipsies. Yeah. After. Hey, so you guys better start thinking of creative things to Google. No. Family <laughs> friendly. Yeah. Oh, it is. Okay. There Smile, you. you're on camera. Yeah. Ah, yeah. Definitely. You can slide down to start it over. Yep. Now you're recording. So now you guys can see what you think. That's cool. Oh, wait, hold on. <laughs> create some inception. Oh, uh, that's. that's Oh. Google Glass is good for something? Google and Google. Google, and Google. <laughs> All right, there's a couple other things you can do with Glass. Even if you're not connected to the internet, you can take pictures and photos. That's pretty easy and straightforward. I can tap to wake up, or I can just raise my head. OK, Glass, take a picture. OK, Glass, record a video. All right, now I'm recording a video. By default, it's going to record for 10 seconds and then stop. But if I push it, now it's gone into extended mode. So now it'll keep recording past 10 seconds. And then when I want to stop it, I can manually stop it by tapping and tapping again to stop. That's basically it. There are other things you can do on the internet, like get directions, but really it just gets you basic functionality. It does do turn-by-turn -turn directions quite well. And it's meant for both uh, biking as well as driving. And you can even get your walking directions.